Um, I'm really excited. It's been a it's been an incredibly long week. Um, it's been a lot of ups and downs. It's been super emotional, especially with like diving with Troy and his last dive today. It was just a lot, but I'm I'm really happy that it went the way it did for me today. I'm really happy with the individual just staying consistent. Um, I felt like I was doing well up until the last dive today just because Troy was going before me and I was watching everyone stand up for him and for me that was so emotional. We've dove together for such a long time and he's taught me so much in this sport. I I went to my first Olympics with him like like kind of because of him. He like never missed a dive when we were diving together. It was just the mo he's the most amazing athlete I've ever met. So it was very very moving experience for me and then I almost fell off the board on my last time because of it. <laughs> It was really cool. It, um, he just said, good luck, you're going to kill it there because he like knew the place that I was in. It was pretty awesome. I mean, he's been to four Olympics now. And so for him to kind of say that, it was almost like passing on the torch. It was a pretty cool moment for me, definitely. <laughs> Weirdly, my mindset was I, I kept kind of replaying that whole day in my head for the last couple two days because we uh, we had a two day break so that's kind of all I was thinking about it was last time I went into this competition and I had a lead it wasn't as big of a lead that I had but I knew that crazy things happened in this final it's Olympic trials like it's stressful it's just an emotional environment um, so I really didn't know what was going to happen but I'm I'm happy that I stayed consistent and I didn't do anything crazy under pressure After, I think after the fourth round, I started to relax a little bit um, just because I'd seen what some of the other competitors were doing in front of me because I was standing there watching them. So I knew that I had, had a pretty big lead. Um, so I kind of started to relax a little bit then, finally, after two weeks. <laughs> Um, I am going to take a little bit of time off. I need it. <laughs> I'm so tired. Um, I'm going to take a little bit of time off, and then I'm going to get back into the weight room, try to increase my strength a little bit. And then if, for individual, thankfully, I, I did the list that I feel really comfortable with. I did an easier list, but I'm going to be working on two harder dives that I was planning on using here in case I really needed them, front four and a half and triple out. Um, thankfully, I didn't. I could use the list that I felt consistent with, but hopefully at the Olympics, I can use those two big dives to try to push for a medal. You know, the strong partisan base in the stands, I'm sure that played to your favor. Yeah, it was, it was awesome. Um, it, at first, I was kind of, <laughs> I didn't know whether I liked how close they were to, usually I kind of like them separate because they're a little bit of a rowdy bunch. Um, but it was actually really cool, and just because this week is so much to handle. It was nice having them that close there. It felt like there was just such a big support team right to the right of me that was helping me along the way. No, I don't. So I did it in four years and then I finished college um, this past fall. Yeah. You're a pro. <laughs> I'm a pro now. <laughs> and at the Sony in Rio, you were able to test it out, I'm sure, a few months ago. Were you there for the trial? Yeah, I was. And, uh, So I, I dive at Stanford, so I feel like that was one of the things that was really beneficial for me last time that I went to Rio, is that we dive in conditions that are incredibly similar to that, so we'll dive outside when it's raining or in the wind or whatever, so when I went there, it really wasn't that big of a difference for me at all. Usually when I come to meets like this that are indoors, it actually it feels like a weight is lifted and there aren't really the barriers that I usually have to dive with. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm excited for it. It'll be just like at home.